The cornea possesses the most dense sensory innervation of the body. It has been estimated that the cornea contains 300 to 600 times more sensory endings than skin and 20 to 40 times more than dental pulp. Imagine a painful toothache magnified many times over for which there is no relief. In LASIK surgery, nerves in the front of the cornea, the most sensitive area, are severed during flap creation, and deeper corneal nerves are destroyed by laser ablation. This leaves the cornea with reduced sensitivity immediately after LASIK. As sensation returns, the patient may be faced with persistent pain. Eye pain after LASIK is frequently diagnosed as dry eye, but there may be more to it than just dry eyes in some cases. Medical studies demonstrate that the corneal nerves do not recover normal densities and patterns after LASIK. Confocal microscopy examinations of post-LASIK eyes reveal aberrant nerve fibers in the cornea, which may lead to cornea neuralgia or corneal neuropathic pain. Other symptoms of corneal neuralgia after LASIK include burning, foreign body sensation, light sensitivity, and extreme sensitivity to dry air or drafty environments. In some cases, the trigeminal nerve may be involved, resulting in severe photophobia or light sensitivity, headache, and facial pain. Corneal neuralgia can transition seamlessly from typical post-LASIK dry eye symptoms or even commence after a pain-free interval. There are no reliable estimates of the rate of corneal neuralgia after LASIK, primarily because most LASIK surgeons don't acknowledge it or track it. Patients with persistent pain after LASIK are routinely treated for dry eyes, treatments which have little to no effect on neuropathic pain. At a 2014 American Academy of Ophthalmology meeting, a renowned eye surgeon was quoted as saying, the cornea is very vulnerable to developing neuropathic pain, end quote. He believes that most corneal specialists see patients with corneal neuralgia every month. The intensity and constancy of corneal neuralgia can be incapacitating and lead to thoughts of suicide. Perry Rosenthal, MD, who is regarded as a leading expert in corneal pain, estimates, estimates that 90% of his corneal neuralgia patients have thoughts of suicide. Testimonials of documented cases of LASIK-related suicide reveal that eye pain was a dominant factor. If you are considering LASIK, ask yourself, is the so-called hassle of glasses and contact lenses really bad enough to risk a life of excruciating eye pain? My advice, keep your glasses.